Okay guys, welcome back for some more uh, gaming with Criticize in uh, Banished with uh, Bordello where we um, are missing people are in a Chinese pinch as we say, I would say we are reaching our limit the peak of our population by that I mean too many old men and not enough young men. That's what the Chinese have now. So many young, so many old people. And it's a fantastic idea in the beginning just to keep a low amount of um, births. But, but, what? Problem is, uh, you're going to have a lot of trouble after that. To expand. To rely on resources, and the resources are going to be so low. Why is the wood over here so high? It's going insane. It's full. The barns are completely full. How are these barns also full? Holy shit, it's full. Layman the woodcutter was accidentally killed with an axe! Ah, how do you get accidentally killed with an axe? You mean you accidentally murdered the guy? Um, fuck, we don't have anyone to do anyone. Oh shit, I didn't notice Olive died! Man, this game though. It's too much. Maybe I should just play at 0 0.5 to, to go to see things uh, go a little bit smoother. But if I go at 0 0.5, just uh, things go too slowly, and then I would get bored. And you guys would get bored as well. Even though I, I keep speaking, it's just not enough to keep yourself like. I'll hit it. Uh, how about the fishing dogs? These fishing dogs are a very good idea. I mean, this guy. Is not producing as much, which is kind of weird. But uh, where is it? A thousand one. Yeah, I don't know why they're not producing that much, but they used to produce quite a lot. Uh oh, more sheep. I don't need any sheep, but you can get me some chicken. Once dismiss, come back with some chickens, my friend. I, I like chicken, a nice food. Yeah, the chicken is the biggest guy. Uh, the guy is gone. Uh, the problem is now we're starting to have people here. This is what I'm talking about. See, see, people are dying too quickly now. We have no builders. This isn't good, this isn't good. Okay, we need to... Um, unfortunately, I have to cut our, our mining expenses for now. We are making some nice uh, weather wool stuff. Uh, where is it? Warm coats. Very nice. Very good. Keep going. Um, I'm gonna have to ask the builders. Where are the builders? What? What did they do with the window? Where is it? I'm going to ask them to build as fast as I can because right now this is getting critical. Right now we're going to be having a big problem if we don't act soon. Oh, this is what I was talking about. This isn't good. This isn't good. Build, build, build. Quicker, quicker, quicker. Come on, come on, come on. Move your asses. Move your asses, move your asses. Come on, come on, come on. Quicker, quicker, quicker. Come on. Why are you going back? What is taking you guys so long? 
I put six of you at work. Do your jobs. Hurry up. We can't do this without iron and stone. Yeah, that's more like it. Come on. Faster, faster, faster. She's the only one doing the work correctly. Faster, 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 faster. Oh. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Nice, nice. Go on, go on. Yes. Very nice. Very good. Oh, yes. Nice. Okay. Zero builders. Uh, I mean, we need one. At least two builders now because we need to make uh, houses like uh, it's our jobs. Go. Go, 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 go. The rest of you go back to stone cutting. As well as uh, making houses. That's right. Very good, very good. This is good, this is good. Let's just keep that woodcutter for now because we don't have the people we need to put him there. Let's get to 250 then. This is going to use quite a bit of resources. Let's hope they can uh, recuperate quite fast. Up, 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 up. Pop, 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 pop. That's right. Keep doing that. Why did I build not a single road here? Oh, that's right. Nice, nice, nice. Keep going. Come on. Move your asses, move your asses. The sheep are like spreading now. <laughs> Boom! People are dying of old age. As long as it's not a disease, then it's all fine. Um, we still haven't reached the cap for the students. Kind of weird, kind of weird. Oh, the sound is kind of nice. Is there is that a well? You, you seriously have water in the middle of the city? And it doesn't put out fires? What's the point then? The well is done. This Two cities are now very safe from fires. There's water near it, so we don't need to worry about it that much. Um. Now, um, you guys are going to be builders. That's perfect. If you guys are builder, just near the stuff, it's just perfect. Forty-seven homes for forty-five families. See, now the families are decreasing. We don't want a decrease, but this is the thing that we need to be very careful about. We need to have a very, very big um, heads up for um, how do you say that? Stability. That's the word. Stability. You do it a, a very nice stability between creating more houses for more families and keeping the old families together because you don't want an expansion too quick if you get it too quick you can't keep up with the food the tiles the production the the uh, amount of food the amount of tools clothes uh, you need to upgrade everything everything needs to have a much uh, a, a larger amount we can't keep up with that we need to do this very slowly but surely 
So right now I did I pressed on the brake for a bit. As you can see because I stopped uh, making houses and then right now I'm like revamping the the production. Like boom. More houses. More. All at once. But the problem now as you can see is I don't have enough uh, stuff. I don't have enough people. Uh, the fishermen are dying and no one is replacing them. So we're having a a tiny food issue now, I guess. As you can see now, it's uh, it's it's uh, stable, which is probably a good thing for you guys. You think? No, it's not. It's a bad thing because that means it's not going up. If it's not going up, then that means it's going down. And if it's going down, that means we're going to reach a recession. When the recession hits, we don't want to be there. You don't want to be there. You don't want to be there when everyone is starving. All the houses are done. I did as many houses as I could. Now it's all up to them to make more families. Because there's more homes than there is families. Right now. It's all up to them. I can't do anything anymore. I stepped too much on the brake, maybe that's the problem. Um, I am thinking of making another village and then another... Uh, blah, blah, blah. We need to make a tunnel here. Or maybe we could just go over it, I don't know. Students, no. Uh, oh, there's the guy with the chickens. We want at least three chickens. Uh, you know what? We're gonna put that to four because we can. Um, so to get to two thousand, when you have four, that's actually five hundred. Math, mathematical genius. Uh, trade. This uh, miss. We have now four chickens, which have no home. Uh -uh. Yes, so they don't have homes. There's one thing that's good about this game is that you don't have to assign people directly to build. You can assign the number of people, but not the people themselves, which is kind of nice if you think about it, because it makes a lot of things easier. The strategic is uh, thing is harder. The, uh, the, the the tactical and strategic part of the game changes uh, very. Uh, quickly but the, the simpler parts just remain the same which make it easier for us okay so I'm thinking about making a fish oh god it's a big mountain in the middle of nowhere that's going to ruin uh, quite a lot of my plans 21 20 17 18 19 20 Okay, it's not the maximum pasture size, but it's quite good enough. And as I told you guys, look at these guys dying. We need, you always need a big pool of people. And this is what happens when you don't build anymore. This is what happens. This is the bullshit that happens. But we definitely seem to have too much food around. What's the limit of my food right now? 40,000? Yeah, we don't need that much. Let's just put it at 30,000. Actually, let's put it at 35,000 because it's going to stop everything else, isn't it? There you go. Now we have leached the maximum amount of sheep, which is perfect. Nomads, actually... Actually... It's a good idea right there to bring them in. You know why? Because we're going to need some people to fill up the places. This is where the nomads come in handy. When I step too much on the brake. They're going to help me clean up a lot of stuff we don't need. They're going to help me expand a lot faster. Come on guys, you need to build the houses. 
Up, 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 up. Move your asses. Come on. Go, 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 go. Are these guys educated? Educated, anyways. That's the one thing I'm asking about. And they're not. That's not such a great thing, actually. Let's uh, put one more uh, guys into making uh, this thing. Okay. Come on. Make the houses. Why are you stopping? That's right. Go, 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 go. I told you guys when there's these guys, there's always an outbreak of something. Work. House. Up. Where's the guy that's sick? Yes. Go visit the dockers, please. Ah, oh, no, no, no. Don't infect. Don't infect anyone. Stay there. Stay there. Don't infect anymore. Just... Ah, he infected someone else. Please don't infect anyone else. Just stay. Ah, don't go. Where are you going? Oh, no, no, no. Please, 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 please. You're going in a school. You're going to infect all the people in the area. Please go, go there. Don't meet anyone. Go directly to that house. Get healed up. And we won't hear anything about you ever again. So, let's put some people to work on those chickens, shall we? Um, I hope these guys just become healthy and don't interrupt anything. Firewood, hide coat and wall. No, I don't need any of that. Incredible! The one guy gets healed up, he's at the hospital, and somebody outside the hospital gets infected. And he goes, Oh god, that's not going to stop! Stop it, guys! Stop it! Go heal! I made this hospital just for you guys! Ah, oh, stop spreading! Take medicine with you! I put all of this medicine out in the streets, not for nothing! Ah. You know what, just die actually, you know, it's easier if you guys die, so we don't have to worry about spreading the disease. If that's what you want to do, okay, just go die, because right now you're just being a nuisance. Just like tiny little rats, just ugh. go to the hospital and stop spreading the diseases. Why are you going? Where are you going? Go to the hospital. There you go. The child died of it is. <sighs> the child died. I fucking told you. I fucking told you. Just stay in that damn hospital. For the love of God, don't spread anymore. Just stay in there. Yes. A bit more. Two more. Come on. Two more of you. One. Oh. We had one child die of the disease. That's how bad nomads are. I told you guys. I told you. I knew the moment we would take these nomads in, a disease would spread out. And it's very lethal. The guy didn't have the, the child didn't have the time to get to the hospital and he died. That's how dangerous it is. The markets with double the amount of food are starting to get full. That speaks uh, for some people. Uh. Wait a second. We're starting to go over. Oh, we're starting to get under. Th th It's definitely starting to get lower. Absolutely. It's a certainty now. Um, food is going to start going down very soon. I know it. It's the same spike like always. Going to waking that uh, wood thing over here. Inventory. Get all that firewood in here. 
just keep it in the inside that uh, trading post outpost. So if we actually need ever anything, we can just take it out of there. <sighs> it's hard to follow the old guys now. I've got to worry about too many things at the same time. Where is the maximum amount of uh, of sheep? Of chips? <laughs> of sheep? Chickens should do fine. I bought four of them. They're quite cheap compared to the other animals. Um, and they grow faster. There comes another one. What do I need to worry about? Let's take a look at the logs. I've seen the logs go down, which is kind of weird. They have started to go down, indeed. Um, but it should stop at uh, one moment. Once I stop trading, that is. Nice, more students, nice. Uh, are we reaching, yes, we're reaching a capacity. Overload! Do we need more houses? Let's check that out. We don't. Let's just keep it like this. And things should stabilize. Um, 29,000 amount of stored food. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Okay. The weird thing here is the stone that's uh, still low as hell. I, I haven't built anything yet, so I don't know why it's, it's, it's keep being used for. I don't know what it's being used for. I have no idea what it's being used for. Uh, 3,000. So you reached the limit, huh? That's good to know. That's good to know. you stop using logs. Actually, we don't need logs that much, do we? Let's keep the logs at 1,500. Oh. There. Stop producing logs. Instead, we're going to be producing Not yet. We could use a chapel because uh, it is the opium of the people, after all. Some kind of our people always need some kind of thing to uh, take away their troubles. We need stone. So now that the production of stone should go up by a lot more. Um, what else should we need? Uh, I don't really have an idea. Uh, I don't really have an idea right now. I'm kind of stuck right now because I don't really know what I am supposed to do. I mean, it's been pretty good right so far. We're pretty safe around every spot. Only, only, only food. Only food is weird. You know what? The solution to our problem is the production tab. We use 522 and we produce what? Are we using more than we produce? No, that's because of the trades, right? Yeah. Stone. Produce 143, use 200. But that's because you get houses. Next. Iron. Produce 95, used 87. That's because we used houses. Fuel. 
we definitely don't use as much as we produce. Fuel is all fine. Tools. Oh. Tools are worrying. Oh. Did you change? Okay. Tools are kind of fine. Food. We're starting to use more than we produce. Right there. That's recession. Herbs are fine. Clothes as well. Clothes as well. Huh, there's kind of a bit problem. Get out of here, you asshole. Um Oh, we're reaching 100, guys! We're already over 100, one thing for sure. How many people do we have right now? 166, holy shit! Man, it's, it's my first city, but it's going very smoothly. Still not one disaster. Oh, yes, actually, yes. Uh, two of them. Two of them. One is the crop. Which got destroyed. What the hell is going on? Why are they killing the crops? Why are they killing the crops? Why are you killing the crops? Why are you killing the crops? It doesn't make sense. You know what? I'm thinking of making another student house. It's clear we need more of this stuff. Schools are the future. So let's make one. Just in case we actually reach a limit. I have no idea what this is all about though. Let's make beer. I'm going to cut this stuff here and make beer instead. You can start making wheat, wheat alcohol. Now, where is the problem? Food. We are going to be lacking in food again pretty soon. We're starting to dwindle right now. Um, the solution to that is none other than um, it's none other than making some more farms. Um, addressing right away or actually do want to make do we want to make more of these guys more of the sheep because we already have the chickens over here 20 yeah you know what let's make Huge pastures, but not here. How about here? No. Let me check on the production of inventory. Warm coats are doing fine. Um, where is this guy? Okay, okay. Where is this? Wool 192. Leather 52. Okay, we need more cows. We need more cows. That's good to know. What do you have to offer? Iron tools, steel tools. the guy with resources, right? 
That means you have stone and iron. I'm gonna ask him to come every time with stone and iron. How about that? Dismiss. And each time we're going to purchase stone and iron from him to ease uh, the fact that we are using this because there's quite a bit of people just working on this stuff but this is going to help boost the amount of stuff we need from them we definitely don't need that many builders but I just not noticed how the hell have we so we have so many guys over here holy shit uh cattle we're going to ask this cattle to split in two. Since you are already over the limit. There you go. You will go over here and work with our old man. Um, we are going to be also needing a crop. Of some kind, 15 out of 15. Where is that? 15 out of 15 is perfect. How about you? You're just being a troll, aren't you? 15 out of 15. Over here. There. So the food is, should be dwindling about now. Look at that. Ropa. That's going to go down quite fast. Um, do we need more? I'm just going to put the student on there, uh, the, the teacher, just in case. We always need more of these uh, educated people. Less uneducated people is not a good thing. Um, current or the farmer that died of old age. Uh -huh. Okay. So, potato, potato, and cabbage. Start of it. Uh, we need more farmers, right? Oh god, we need a lot more. There. How many does that make? Three, three, two, two, three. Yeah, should be good enough. To put uh, six herdsmen to help stuff grow, and let's hope that this is enough to get our food back up. I'm not sure if it is, but. It is. So we have more workers now. It's perfect. It's very good. Very good. Very very good. Um, let's hope the guys uh, comes with uh, the stones, so we can start to expand quicker now. Because I don't want to rely too much on mining and the quarry. If we can make a safe business out of uh, wood. More exactly, uh, fuel. If we can make a fuel business with the traders, including rocks, uh, not rocks, I mean uh, iron, we don't need to rely on anything but the wood. Right on there, right on time. So, how much would this cost? Okay. That would cost quite a lot, it would seem. Especially stone, you cost quite a lot. I'm going to take as much stone as possible. That's uh, 770. That's okay. Oh! It's quite cheap, actually. I mean, it's not cheap, but we definitely can take a bit more of this stuff with us. One, one, one thousand, one hundred. 
Well then, uh, how about 1,500 then? Okay. Perfect. Um, let's get this much, this much iron and this much stone. So 800, no, 720 iron and 200 stone. Dismissed. Let me see those numbers go up. I want to see those numbers go up. Oh! Oh! Oh, yes! We all love that! What this is going to help us do is build more houses if we need to. Do we need to? 72 families! What did I tell you guys? What did I tell you guys? Let's go. Um, where do we build them? I guess around here, huh? Go on, I bought a lot of it. Don't worry. Is there someone working here? Taking the stuff back into here? We need to fill that up with the fire with as soon as possible. Do your work, come on. I didn't hire so many firewood men for nothing. Okay, so the chapel is quite full. <laughs> With that we can immediately see how many people there are. 179 people right now. 180 guys. That's quite an amazing number if you ask me. If you guys ever worry about how, how you can win this, just follow my strategy more or less and keep an eye on the numbers at the top of the production bar keep checking the production used and produced very important make sure you produce always more than what you use and as soon as I say that the used thing is all the way up so now that we have quite a bit of stone of course we can Nonchalantly rely on it to make houses. <laughs> I'm going to put a little bit less uh, stone cutters and miners. If we don't need them, we are going to put a little bit less of them. But what we can definitely use is more gatherers, one, fishermen, and hunters. There, the food is what we need. How is food going? Still going down. It's not good news. Uh, that means I might start thinking about expanding for a more forests, lodges, and things like that. Her Stefani, the woodcutter, has died of old age. Mele has replaced Stefani as a woodcutter. A child named Harlow was born. A child named Lynetta was born. A child named Durwoody was born. Where did these guys come from? From this one, huh? It's sad you can build a bridge and then a fisher lodge right in the middle of it. That would be quite amazing. Let's see what these guys have to check before ending this episode because I think we're the limit. Uh, oh, he, wow! He really likes me. Look at all that stone! <gasps> oh my love of food! <laughs> How much for 600 stone? Ah, that's quite a lot. Uh, okay, so it takes it quite a lot further, of course. So, 400. So yeah, we're paying by quite a bit. 
Nice. Very nice. Um, so then again, yet again, um, I just put a lot of stone and iron back into the city, which is fantastic for production. Let's see this uh, gray as these things go. Boom! Look at that. This guy is kind of slow. He hasn't moved the iron and stuff yet from the, the village. He's just staying there. Do I need to put one more guy in there? I guess so. I guess it's just not we're going to get into the city then. Um, how is it going? 62 homes for 74 families. That sounds about right. Just keep it around there. You don't want too many houses. Do not try to match the numbers, otherwise you will just go over a ridiculous amount of uh, resources needed to keep up. Oh, did the food go back up? I didn't check. It's not going back up. Or is it? I have no clue. It's kind of hard to tell. Um, yeah, I don't know. Let's, uh, start building some bridges here and there. Why can you not make a bridge? Why are you being such a dick about it? Um, I want to start making roads. There. Then. It's a nice forest of lodge, as well as a gatherer's hut. There. As well as a hunting cabin. That's too far. That's going to boost our production quite a bit. Might not look like it, but it's going to help us quite a bit. We're going to need to put down a stockpile, as well as a few stone houses. Should do the trick. There. So guys, now you know as well as I do, the trick to getting the stone and the iron is not by mining it into the ground, it's by maximizing the output of firewood by building woodcutters, as well as these remote settlements. And then just building the fuck out of firewood. Why is this not emptying? Why is this not getting pulled out in the city? Fourteen pillars, there we go. 
Foresters. We're going to need uh, to put down a storage barn as well. There. They're building incredibly fast. That's going fast. That's what I like to see. Go, 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 Power Rangers! As I would like to say, but that's fucking gay. Um, that's some weird thing, you know, you never know why it became popular. Like, for example, Power Rangers. What the fuck was Power Rangers about? Saving the world by suiting up into weird costumes and then going out and doing weird stuff. Just, uh, whatever. Build, 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 build. Go, 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 go! We need food! Um, foresters, the little hunters. Uh, gatherers. There we go. That should boost our production by quite a bit by now. We also get some stone out of it. I think these guys are finally moving. Yes, the stone is finally back into the city. It took so quite some time. I think it was quite a lot of amount. So they had quite some trouble following. Let's try to uh, get more of these guys back. <laughs> Do you see? That? This is what I call production, right there. I will end this video right here because I really, really took way too long to end this fucking episode. But look at that! Oh, that's so beautiful. That's so lucky. Oh. Like, ah, uh, so nice. Cows, chickens, sheep, plum, wheat, beans, chestnuts, beers, everything. We have everything. Alcohol. Do we have alcohol? Yes, we do. We do have alcohol. We have everything. Too much of everything. We have 1,500 um, iron. That's pretty fucking crazy. Uh, uh -huh. Nice! Everything is done! So, are you doing? Oh my god, that's going to boost the food like crazy. Let's check it out. Okay, I'm less worried now. We can finally end this video with our just uh, free of any concerns and see all each other's, all of each other's uh, in uh, the next video. Peace.